Good morning. It's Friday, December the 11th. Know this, the Lord himself is God. He himself has made us and we are his. We are his people and the sheep of his pasture. Lead me, O Lord, in your righteousness. Make your way straight before me. Hosanna, Lord, Hosanna. Lord, send us now success. Blessed is he who comes in the name of the Lord. We bless you from the house of the Lord. God is the Lord. He has shined upon us. Form a procession with branches up to the horns of the altar. Let not those who, put, uh, who hope in you be put to shame through me, Lord God of hosts. Let not those who seek you be disgraced because of me, O God of Israel. Of the baptizer, scripture says, a feeling of expectancy had grown among the people who were beginning to wonder whether John might be the Messiah. So John declared before them all, I baptize you with water, but someone is coming, someone who is more powerful than me, and I am not fit to undo the strap of his sandals. He will baptize you with the Holy Spirit and fire. His winnowing fan is in his hand to clear his threshing floor and to gather the wheat into his barn. But the chaff he will burn in a fire that will never go out. And he proclaimed the good news to the people with many other exhortations too. Let not those who hope in you be put to shame through me, Lord God of hosts. Let not those who seek you be disgraced because of me, O God of Israel. Blessed is the Lord, for he has heard the voice of my prayer. The Lord is my strength and my shield. My heart trusts in him, and I have been helped. Therefore my heart dances for joy, and in my song will I praise him. The Lord is the strength of his people, a safe refuge for his anointed. Save your people and bless your inheritance. Shepherd them and carry them forever. Let not those who hope in you be put to shame through me, Lord God of hosts. Let not those who seek you be disgraced because of me, O God of Israel. O God, come to my assistance. O Lord, make haste to help me. Our Father in heaven, hallowed be your name. Your kingdom come, your will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us today our daily bread and forgive us our sins as we forgive those who sin against us. Lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from the evil one. For yours is the kingdom, the power, and the glory forever and ever. Amen. Merciful God, who sent your messengers, the prophets, to preach repentance and prepare the way for our salvation. Grant us grace to heed their warnings and forsake our sins, that we may greet with joy the coming of Jesus Christ, our Redeemer, who lives and reigns with you and the Holy Spirit, one God, now and forever. Amen. Lord God, almighty and everlasting Father, you have brought me in safety to this new day. Preserve me with your mighty power that I may not fall into sin nor be overcome by adversity. And in all I do, direct me to the fulfilling of your purpose through Jesus Christ, my Lord. Amen. May God richly bless you today and always.